Grand Theft Auto. Released in 2001, Grand Theft Auto 3 was a watershed moment in video games. It defined the genre of open world games, with a level of freedom to that point unseen. But more importantly, did you know that Agent Cooper was in it? Well, the the actor uh, that played Dale Cooper, Kyle MacLachlan, the most recognizable voice of Twin Peaks. Federal Bureau of Investigation. Special Agent Dale Cooper. Hank Lock himself, Mr. C, Dougie oh. Jones, Dougie Love, Richard, what? voiced the character in Grand Theft Auto 3. Get the fuck out of that booth. Someone manufactured. Before you. he was Dougie Love, he was Donald Love. What? First of all, let me thank you for dealing with that personal matter. People will read something into anything these days. Experience has taught me that a man like you can be very loyal for the right price, but groups of men get greedy. A valued resource, an old oriental gentleman I know, has been kept hostage by some South Americans in Espatria. They're trying to extort additional funds from me, but I don't believe in renegotiation. A deal is a deal, so they'll not see a penny from me. Go and rescue my friend. Do whatever it takes. Donald Love's voice sounds much more rushed than the Cooper we're all accustomed to. Like he's a coked up businessman, which makes sense for the seedy real estate developer he's embodying. Though his character is at the opposite side of morality as Cooper, Kyle MacLachlan's voice still summons that same air of authority. When you first find Donald Love, he's standing near an oriental garden on the top of a skyscraper. Perhaps the same skyscraper that houses a room with a giant glass box. The mission that precedes him hints at his Mr. C-like nature, describing a man who is being blackmailed for doing unseemly things with corpses. I know a real important man in town, a soft touch with, uh, shall we say, exotic tastes and the money to indulge them. He's involved in a legal matter, and the prosecution has some rather embarrassing photos of him at a morgue party or something. He functions like all of the characters in GTA 3 as a mission provider. Do this for me. Collect the object. Kill the person. Nothing drives down real estate prices like a good old-fashioned gang war, apart from an outbreak of plague. But that might be going too far in this case. I've noticed the Yakuza and the Colombians are far from friends. Let's capitalize on this business opportunity. I want you to kill the Yakuza Wakagashira, Kenji Kassen. Kenji is attending a meeting at the top of the multi-story car park in Newport. Get a cartel gang car and eliminate him. The Yakuza must blame the cartel for this declaration of war. And then like D.B. Cooper, he just whoosh, disappears. It is assumed that he runs off with his newly ill-gotten gains, and since then Kyle MacLachlan has never appeared in a video game. The other appearances of Donald Love in the GTA franchise aren't voiced by Kyle MacLachlan, which is a damn shame, because in Liberty City Stories, there's apparently a mission where you find out that Donald Love is a cannibal and says humans taste like chicken, but more sentient, which would have been gangbusters when voiced by Coop. Is it worth seeking out GTA 3 today based solely on Kyle MacLachlan's performance? Maybe not, but it's an interesting interlude in K. Glock's early 2000s career and his solo video game appearance. But wait, isn't there a Desperate Housewives game? And now it's time for a public service announcement from station owner Donald Love. Hello, my name is Donald Love. You're listening to a Love Media station. Enjoy Love Media, bringing people and the finest in entertainment together. It's time for a public service announcement from Donald Love. Hello, I'm Donald Love. Under my guidance, Love Media has emerged as the fastest growing US run media conglomerate of the past five years. With newspapers, television, and radio stations across the US and the free world, alongside a wide array of industrial and technology interests, we at Love Media ensure you get the truth behind the story every time. From films to dog food, from radio to pop music, you can be sure of independent, quality-led broadcasting every time you tune in. That's why we're the fastest growing cable supplier and health insurance provider in the Northeast. 
and why our new satellite in China is something all Americans can be proud of. Here at Love Media, we are proud of what we have done to help America and to help hard-working Americans relax. For investment opportunities or information about our new interactive television service, please go to www.lovemedia.tv. Ooh, that makes me feel all warm and fuzzy. Ah, huh? well, the red light on the wall is flashing, which means that the owner of the station has an important announcement to make. Let's go live to his office. Hello, my name is Donald Love. You're listening to a Love Media station. Enjoy. Wow, man, that was deep. 